starts off this way. Pipe. Uh, there seems to be moon and star up there? That's right. We can look all around the map. <laughs> so we've, we've got the moon and a star out above the ocean there. Some kind of weird pumpkin. Yep. Um... Mario! What? <laughs> okay! It's a statue of Mario. There's a, a turtle. A giant Koopa. A pipe on the island there. There's the castle. There's some kind of weird hippo? Hippo Mountain. So where are we going to go to next? Uh, well I'm over here, so let's do the pumpkin zone? Pumpkin Zone! <laughs> okay, it, it's actually called Pumpkin Zone. We're gonna chase that witch down. Well, first let's do this weird graveyard. I think it's more Halloween Zone than Pumpkin? Well, it's a zone inside of a pumpkin, so... It's a, I assume that's a Goomba in there. Yeah, that's been stabbed. It's got a the hockey mask on. Yeah, the mask has been stabbed clean through. Platforms exist the whole time, they just fade from view. You gotta watch out for those boo diddlies. Yep, 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 screwing up. Ah, screwing up. Oh, checkpoint. Okay, some of the spikes fall, good to know. I was expecting him to fall faster. Things fall very slowly in this game. Except Mario. Mario falls at a speed that is normal that I expect. Enemies just kind of don't like obeying gravity, though. <laughs> like, look at that. Look at how slow that fall was. Vampire spewing bats! Well, I hope you get up to this life. Pop. Pop. Oh. Whoops. Oh well. Well, you found the goal. Okay, paper lanterns. Yokai. So we've gone from a very American Halloween spoop to a very Oriental style. Yeah, this, uh, it, it should really be Pumpkin Zone. Pumpkins aren't really associated with Japanese mythology spooky stuff, are they? Something. I'm not sure if that's a floating flame or just a ghost. It seems thing. like a ghost. Oni! Man, this is weird. Fish are afraid. Okay, let's 
just sort of a loop around. Another ghost spawned! Oh, is it just above there? It may have just been above there. Dang. Can I get up to that carrot this way? Yes! vulnerable really uh, eliminates any kind of spooky atmosphere this might have. Haha! -ha. And I probably had to like glide all the way across up there jump for jump on the... those umbrellas. Yeah, one of those. Ghost. Goomba ghost. Ghostba. assumed that any of the monster things that died around here would just become regular booze, but apparently no, there are specific Goomba ghosts as well. They seem to have the same pattern as Eerie's. But much slower, because everything in this game is kind of slower when it comes to the air. Skipping over gaps. Blue. Apparently, I found a secret exit. Hooray. Okay. What? Ah. It goes outside. Beyond pumpkin zone. To mushroom stock zone. Uh, let's not get fire. Let's just hover over the world. Hover over everything. Okay, if I brought fire, I could have gotten that life. Instead, I got that life. It's kind of a side zone, and then I'm back to the, the house. Well, gotta do all this again. Now, where was the actual path? Because I didn't take what looked... I, I don't think I took any kind of side path. <laughs> Just uh, okay. This is just like not pits. They look like pits, but you can save yourself. Hmm. Let's try not flying over everything. Well, I can't anymore. So uh, that'll be easy. Okay, yeah, if you can't fly, you have to drop down, and I guess that's where the difference was. Uh, 
Okay. I was kind of hoping for a power-up, but I'll take three more lives. <laughs> now let's go inside this spooky skull head thing. Glowing. Uh... That's some kind of lamprey? That's disturbing. I'm not gonna touch it. Go through the curtain. It's some kind of pot. Can I go down? No. Just, just don't get in the pot. And more of these electric spike ball things. Okay, you can jump on those. This game has a lot of unique enemy types. Like, un unless they start reusing enemies a lot, then we're gonna be seeing, like, unique enemies for almost every stage. <laughs> Was a broom that I killed? Yeah, magic broom. Okay, specimen jars. More of these hockey mask killer dead goomba things. Break these bricks. No. Uh, okay, that was a trap. Finding all these treasures. Can't go up that one. Okay, so they're all bad, I assume. Uh oh, now the witch. No? Okay. For a moment I thought it was gonna be just like Wendy Koopa pattern. Of popping out of those three uh -oh. pots. There's spikes on the top of the ceiling. So there are, so there are. Didn't even notice that. Well, I jumped into spikes, but I beat the witch. What is that corpse that she has hanging up there? Some kind of weird lizard dragon thing? Ugh. Dinosaur. Anyway, I got a pumpkin coin. Yay! This, this is only is gonna weird. take like two sessions. I thought it was gonna be a little longer than that. Mm. There's another secret that looks it looks like. Yeah, possibly. Uh, I'll... I don't want to go searching around through things right now. I'm not sure where that would be, so... I'll look it up afterwards. So, we have the statue of Mario. We have the giant Koopa. Let's go into Mario Zone. It's a weird wind-up robot Mario, and I'm entering its shoe. I think this is the most disturbing thing we've seen so far. Welcome to Mario, Mario. There's a bunch of gears. It's like some kind of Castlevania clock tower in here. Castlevania Clock Tower, check out the Castlevania Chronologically series on this YouTube channel. Cross promotion? Ooh, 
Mushroom. Surprised you didn't get hit by anything there. Well, I am good at video games. Oh, well. That's unlike me. Casually hover across. It's a lot of machinery for your foot. Well, I mean, I, I, I am ascending, so I might not be in the foot anymore. I might have gone up the leg some amount. Like, presumably that's what all of these gears are for, is for... Oh god. Oh. It's for powering the, the leg. Mm-hmm. Assuming the thing even can move. I don't know if well, it can... Well, now you're in the stomach. Oh. What am I standing on? What the hell is that? It's a pig cannon. What am I looking at? I don't... What? You're looking at Mario's stomach. I'm going to run away. Seems to be full I hit of gumballs. a cannonball. Some of them are spiky. Yeah, well, Mario lives dangerously. Giant robot Mario, at least. Mm -hmm. Seriously, who built this thing? Did Mario what? have it commissioned? Seeing as it's next to Mario's castle. Like, did Mario just think, I want a giant robot that I can pilot one day? Maybe. I mean, if you were the savior of a kingdom and they would make anything for you. I can't really argue with that. Maybe he thought he would need it one day. Why is there a bear? On a ball. Dancing bear inside Robot Mario's stomach. What is going on? And you wanted to try and make sense of all of this. I'll be, I'll get there eventually. Just Not allow today. me my surprise. <laughs> Dancing bear. And I'm gonna ride his ball. Well, this is very, play. very slow ball. Oh, there's the bell. Oh, checkpoint bell. Yeah, they're basically the same bell. Ah. Okay, cannon pigs are flammable. That is good. Roast pork. Which one do I take? Let's see number two. You it took was the wrong the one. The worst one. In fact, you took the only wrong yep. one. Yep. Let's play it safe then. I can get a power up. I got a flower. And now you're in Mario's tongue. Why? Well. Ah! Ah! Crazy Jack in the Box. There's a Jack in the Box in that box. Are those background elements? I don't know. 
I think those are, yeah, these are definitely actual spikes that I was just plowed through with that free star I got. Weird. And yeah, like, wooden soldiers, I assume. Ooh. Bullet bill. Large bullet bills. Yeah. Horrible jack in the box. What is this toy land? It's this toy Stop. land inside of a toy Mario. Uh-oh. Crane game? Just going to very... Cautiously not move. Okay, okay. I think it would have dropped me there if I hadn't jumped out of it. Is this... Okay, I can stand on these. They are not spiky. Yep. Okay, that lower one isn't firing. Okay, this this moves. That's weird. All right, green game. Nothing, not weird. Just let this carry me over to the bell. <laughs> over a bunch of spice that you didn't see. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can get a power up. You nope. failed. I got nothing. <laughs> And now, Mario's brain. Inside the hat. Lego land. Because it, it... This is just a weird amalgam of, like, machinery and a toy land thing. What is this, this world? This is... I, I don't even. Mario confronts his greatest enemy himself. And also horrible jack-in-the-boxes inside coins. That's that's also... Well, they're jack-in-the-boxes inside boxes. Like, the entire jack-in-a-box yes. assembly is inside a box. Yes. Now the cannon pigs are black. They weren't black before, right? No, they were... Gray. Blades. Why would you need saws? Don't cut your Legos. The plastic construction toy. The three little pigs. What? What? Is this gonna be three boss fights? Yeah! Okay! Three simple boss fights. This one was a smart one, he made his house a brick. He bounces high! Alright. You defeated the three little pigs inside Mario's brain. <laughs> I just... Uh... Well, got I've the got Mari the Mario coin, and that makes the end of the hour. Yeah. So, uh, this has been Super Mario Land 2, and it's bizarre. Yeah. Come back next time, where we'll probably just finish it. Yep. And we'll get to see Wario in all his glory. For the first time. So if you uh, enjoyed, like, subscribe, tell your friends. We'll be back on Saturday, same time, 6 p.m. Until then, see ya. Bye.